I'm astronaut Wealthy. Come join me to travel through space. Hi guys, so today for my channel, we will be discussing about the solar system. That's why we're here in space. Look at that. Look at that planet over there. See? But before we discuss all of that, we have a very, very special guest. Can you guess who? No, you can't because you haven't met her yet. Her name is Vlessie, my little adorable sister. Say hi, Vlessie. Hi. Okay. So if you don't know about the solar system, that's why I'm here to tell you all about it. The solar system is the sun and all the objects that orbit around it. The solar system is about 4.6 billion years old. It formed by gravity in a large molecular cloud. Also, there are eight planets. Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune! We'll be discussing one by one. This is the solar system. The sun is the star at the center of the solar system. It is a nearly perfect sphere of hot plasma with internal convective motion that generates a magnetic field via a dynamo process. It is by far the most important source of energy for life on Earth. The first planet is Mercury. Mercury is the planet closest to our sun. It is a small rocky planet, much like our moon. It is covered with craters and has changed very little from when it was first formed. You can see Mercury with binoculars or with your eyes. Venus is the second planet from the sun because Venus is so similar to Earth. We sometimes call it Earth's sister planet. Most of Venus's surface consists of gently rolling planes. It is the brightest star in the sky. Earth is the third planet from the sun. 71% of the Earth's surface is covered with water. Earth is the only planet on which water can exist in liquid form on the surface. Besides being the most interesting and unique of all the planets, our Earth is also the most beautiful. Mars is the fourth planet from the Sun. It is often referred to as the red planet. Water corrosion shows that it used to have water. The southern part of Mars is mostly ancient, cratered highland. The northern part consists mostly of plains. Jupiter is the fifth planet from the sun and is the largest. Jupiter does not have a solid surface due to its gaseous composition. The swirls and bands we see are the tops of clouds high in its atmosphere. Jupiter has faint rings like Saturn's, but much smaller. Saturn is the sixth planet from the sun and the second largest. Saturn's nine beautiful rings are made of ice particles, some rocks, and dust. Saturn is mainly composed of hydrogen and helium and does not have a solid surface. 62 moons orbit the planet. Uranus is the seventh planet from the sun. Uranus's blue color is the result of gas called methane. It has no solid surface like the other gas planets. Uranus has rings. Uranus's rings are very dark like Jupiter's rings. 
Neptune is the eighth planet from the sun. Its blue color is the result of gas called methane. Neptune has rapid winds trapped in bands, which are the fastest in the solar system, reaching 2,000 km hour. Neptune is also very dark and very faint rings. Did you know there are five dwarf planets recognized in our solar system? Ceres, Makemake, Haumea, Eris, and Pluto. Thank you for watching. I hope you all learned. Please like, share, and subscribe.